Hey guys, welcome back to more Hearthstone today. Uh, we are back on my Prince Hunter deck, and let's see what happens. Alright, so this hand kind of sucks. I'll just pitch everything. Still haven't had an opening hand Prince on record. Had it when I was playing without recording. Never get it when I'm recording, so... Ugh, okay, that's not good for us. I think we'll just play the tracker to try to find some, you know, sort of bigger damage spell or something. We can also just play Bear Shark, the most aggressive play. It's probably right, because we need to reduce his life total as soon as possible. This could mean, like, just a Doomsayer, which we can bow down. Or we can actually just Deadly Shot it. Yeah, we'll Deadly Shot that. We don't have time to fight through your Tar Creeper. Sorry. So the next turn we probably grub hero power. Oh, that's not good. Hmm. So I think instead we tar creeper hero power because we don't want to uh, have that killing our guy. The tar creepers have been really good for me so far in this deck. Um, I like them a lot. If he kills this one, we can follow up with our second Tar Creeper. Uh, if he doesn't kill it, um, then we can go... Probably still play our second Tar Creeper and... Bow. Oh, that's mean. Okay. So I think we just... Maybe we bow and Grub here, or Bow and Stitch Tracker. Let's Stitch Tracker first. I'll take a Houndmaster here, uh, and then we'll Bow attack this. Of course, then we can not attack the next turn, but we don't really care that much about that right now. Uh, what's important to us is maximizing damage. Um, the Tracker dies to a Blizzard here, which is pretty likely to be what he plays. But we have follow-up like Grub into Houndmaster. Okay. Basically the same thing as Blizzard, except I get to attack. It could be like, um, I'm, it's either Ice Barrier or Ice Block. Let's just check. Could be vaporized, but probably not. Okay, so it's barrier. So just go ahead and do this. Basically, our goal is to apply enough pressure to kill him before he can combo off. Right now, he's only seen 11 cards, so his potential to be able to combo is pretty low. He hasn't cast a single spell that wasn't from his deck. So, so far we're doing okay. Um, if we can find our Dispatch Kodo or Kill Command for direct damage, we can get around Taunts. It's so like right now we pop his Ice Block next turn, which is huge. Okay, now we don't. Still have our 4-3 though. So that's, that's the reason why I pumped the Carrying Grub, uh, is because, okay, so that helps us, but we don't really want to use it right now. We want to just use this. I think we can track in here. Oh, okay. That was unexpected. I forgot that they ran that card. Okay, so if it's that, then we just do kill command and he's dead.
Easy peasy. Yeah, so I was worried about being an ice block. It wasn't an ice block, so we just kill him. Alright, so thus far, uh, Priest has proven to be one of our most difficult matchups. I'm just going to keep the Macaw and hope to draw a Prince. And draw a Prince. So the reason that Prince is a hard matchup for us is because we just don't have the late game to beat him. And our early game isn't fast enough. Okay, King Crush is good. That's something that can, so like after he end wins and kills, you know, our board, we can just King Crush for eight, which can be huge because it, it having charge is really relevant. So, um, I think I don't want to play the second Macaw. I just want to wait. Um, I want to wait into Bow. Actually, we might just grub. If we grub next turn. Grubbing next turn is good because then it becomes a 4-7. And as a 4-7, it doesn't die to any of the removal. So, let's do that. If he shadow words it now, then it's a problem. But if we can uh, make it a 4-7, then... Um, we're in a really good position. Okay, that's fine. Have to attack there. Um, he can attack into it now and then make it vulnerable to dragon fire, but, um, I think we actually might be in a position to do okay in this game. We can tracker hero power next turn, or we could just uh, bow. I think tracker is better because it maximizes damage in the long run. Because we'll, prob we'll probably find a three drop off it. Like the majority of our deck is at three. Um, that's annoying. Okay, so maybe we bow now. Just so we can get rid of that. He's still able to Yeah, like I can't waste time attacking his minions. Like, yeah, if he dragon fires here or whatever, all of our stuff dies, sure. But we can um because he has coin. So if he coins, he doesn't coin. So now we're in a really good position because we can follow up with high main. He can't kill my guy right now. And we have one, two, three, four, five plus 8. We have 13 damage and he's at 17. Actually, we he didn't play any heals, so we have lethal now. 2, 3, 4, 5, plus 8, and then plus kill command. No, or double kill command, that works too. All right, Grub is good. Who knew four attack creatures are good against Priest?